What is going on everybody, my name is Kelly Mike today and welcome back to another video. Now in today's video guys, what I'm about to show you is a max rank glitch. You guys can do on Black Ops 4 Zombies and it is an awesome glitch to do. And what it will allow you guys to get is to max rank or max rank a thousand. So if any of you guys haven't got there yet, this is the time to do so and it is pretty easy to do. So what you need to do is go onto a game of Rush, Blood of the Dead, Solo. Before you start that game, you want to go to your Alexos. You want to put on Equipped Mint, that's going to refresh your cooldown on your equipment. Temporary Gift, that allows power-ups to last longer. Arsenal Accelerator, which charges your special weapon faster, only lasts 2 minutes though. And Pop Shots, this allows a melee attack, trigger and electric static discharge. Now those 4 Alexors are going to help you, you don't have to put all 4 on, but as long as you put a couple of them, that will help you. And they're all free. From there, you want to go to your perks, you want to put on time slip, and this allows equipment to cooldown rate increases, so that makes your cooldown on your basic equipment to increase, so you'll be able to use it faster. Then go to weapons, and you want to make sure your regular rocks, DG5s are on, and that your equipment is on wave fire. Now the wave fire will allow a blue alchemical flame that will burn the zombies, and it will help you to fill up your specialist weapon. Then from starting weapon, you can over put on the Sarge if you've got it. If not, just put any normal standard gun and you can just buy guns from the wall. Once you go into a gang then guys, you're going to be spawned in at the Richtofen's lab slash the modern industrials. From there, you just want to kill enough zombies so the door opens because the door's going to be closed at that point. Then from there, you want to make your way over to the West Grounds. Now once you're over in the West Grounds guys, you're going to have to kill a number of zombies in this location. It's going to get harder as each area you basically get past and you want to do that until the next door opens. That's going to either bring you into the new industrial building or the powerhouse. If you go to the new industrial building, you can then pick up this gun from this wall and shoot all the zombies. Pick up the drops to end that basically round. Now once you end that area, what's going to happen is another area is going to open up and you just want to make sure that you pick up the shield from this table. It's always going to be there so you don't have to worry, it will always be at this area in the tunnels. Then make your way over to the powerhouse which will be the last place or if you're coming from the powerhouse make your way over to the new industrial building. While you're over here you can pick up the actual brew machine perk that you have chosen. Hopefully you've picked the one that I told you which is the time slip. From here you just want to cover this area until the actual blue lights of the actual door frame area goes away so that means you can come out of here and you've completed this challenge now this is where you guys need to do the glitch in order for you to succeed all you want to do is come up the stairs here you don't want to process or proceed over to the catwalk you want to make sure you avoid that area you want to jump on top of here using your dg5s now if you get on there and the zombies hit you you need to just jump off just what i did there and jump back on using your dg5s now, if the zombies do pull up nice sludge right below you, you know you're in the right position. And this is where this glitch is going to come in play. And you can actually pick up trophies while doing this. So if any of you guys haven't played Rush, you'll be able to pick up some trophies. There'll be a couple of trophies that you'll be able to get while doing this game mode. Now, as you can see on screen right now, at the bottom left, you can see I've got to 4 million points. Now, that's the highest you're going to get to those points. Once you get to 4 million, it won't go any higher up. But what will go high is the multiplier to the right of it. So every time you shoot or kill a zombie, either using your weapons, your DG5s, your wildfire grenades, or any other weapons that you've got, that multiplier will slowly go up. And it will base on how many zombies you kill with how much the multiplier goes up. So for every zombie, it will go up by one. Now what you want to do is you want to make sure that multiplier is going up as much as as you possibly can and you don't want to break it in the system so you don't want to wait because the longer you wait it will slowly go down so you need to always be killing zombies now a good little tip is to have a shield obviously and if you run out of ammo or you've got no equipment you can either use your uh, what's it called Alexa called equipment and that will refresh your equipment or if you haven't got that ready and it's not ready you can always use your shield to use the kid to zap the zombies and actually kill one or two zombies to keep that multiplier at bad. And then once you fill up your specialist or your Alexa are filled up, you can then uh, basically start using it and start keep killing the zombies. 
As you can see right on screen there, I'll just pause the game to show you that my level was at a certain level. And if I pause it again now, you'll notice I've gone up slightly. So the, the actual number of XP has gone down. So you do gain XP, but you might need to make sure that when you do this, you are not stopping killing zombies. You have to always be killing the zombies because you want to make sure that multiplier is going as high as possible. And the higher it goes, the more you level up. And the more you level up, it'll be quicker and faster. And eventually, you'll get to that Master Prestige um, in pretty much no time, guys. So apart from that, it has been your boy, Channel Max Third. Tell me what you think in the comment section below about this. Tell me what level you guys actually make it to, what level you guys are on at the moment. Uh, at the moment, I'm at Master Prestige, level 6 third, And... Big shout out to the credit guide, which is it's me again, NL. So thank you, mate. And it's been Channel Max Day. I'm out. Bye bye.